So medication safety is a huge issue for pet owners. Not only do we need to be safe around our own medications that we administer to ourselves, but we often wonder what sorts of medications can I give to my dog safely without maybe going to see the veterinarian first. Dogs are, are like us, they get aches and pains, they get sick now and then, and wouldn't it be nice to be able to treat some of those ailments at home without having to rush to the vet? The problem is, is that medications designed for humans aren't always safe for animals. One of the big ones, we use a lot of non-steroidal anti-inflammatory agents in ourselves, things like ibuprofen, aspirin, Tylenol, all these little medic uh, these over-the-counter medications that are designed to help with pain. Uh, they're not safe for dogs by and large. And the rule of thumb is you probably shouldn't give it to your dog unless you have specific uh, authorization or advice from your veterinarian. Aspirin in very small quantities might be okay for some dogs. And I have to say it that way because every dog reacts a little bit differently. But of all the over-the-counter medications, aspirin's probably the safest. Ibuprofen you absolutely, absolutely positively need to avoid in dogs. Just one over-the-counter dose for some dogs is enough to perforate their stomach. Dogs are very, very sensitive to the adverse effects of that one. There are NSAIDs, or non-steroidal anti-inflammatories, that are safer to use in dogs, and those are the ones that typically you get by prescription from your veterinarian. But the human ones, even the over-the-counter ones, typically are very unsafe for dogs. Naproxen is another one where there are good case reports that just after a single low dose, dogs have perforated their stomachs. So you want to be very, very careful.